five all in the fourth. Oh, that almost spun away from uh, Big Burma. And it's over on second touch. That's not good news for Germany. And Nishida comes in. Lovely pick up one handed from Kampa. And the cross court doesn't get a win there from Hirsch, though. Nishida does get through with the cross court. Some big swinging and hitting. Lacking power. Koga with the dig. Nishida off the block. And that's another point Japan's way. Closing the gap back to 14 6. Oh, what a pickup. Bumped over the top. That was sensational from Nishida. He's showing it full. Five Canada. Good hit. Brilliant hit. Oh, Japan once again staying in the rally. Canada now, surely. Sklater out. What? Oh, Philip off again. Excellent defence. Nishida. Well, he's made a real difference again. He loves it. He's absolutely pumped up here. Madeira with the jump float on to die. Not a great pass, not a great set. Japan for the point. Ishikawa goes off pace and it doesn't get easier than that. And I'm afraid Japan look beaten. Uh, China look beaten and Japan look like they're going to walk this now. Well, with all the testating serve, this isn't one of the big servers that Japan are sending out, but Germany making an absolute mess of this. That wasn't the best service reception. Where's that going to go? Strong wrists on the German side, but uh, finally they say enough is enough. Camper. They, they nearly made a mess of this. The service reception was awful. Camper did very well to just pick it up there. Decent touch. Oh, too good. Well, Sakita knew that the opposite player, Peng, in the middle, would not be able to recover in time after his attack. So he's just run Yamauchi off this terrific piece of defence. And sure enough, Peng wasn't really ready. Twenty-two nineteen. This is a bit of a problem. Yeah, an overpass there from Onodera. Iran will get a second bite at this. Brilliant dig in the back court there from Nishida. And there is a whistle there that gives the point to Japan. After the infraction, uh, the Iranians were on full scramble mode here. If Badipur couldn't find a winner, thanks to Nishida's one. Now it will stay on serve. Ishikawa handles that. Ishikawa will look to finish it. Can't do it. Maike is there. A bit of a mix up. Douglas can't find a winner. Great backcourt scramble and then sent down the line by Yuki Ishikawa. Probably not exaggerating to say that was a must win point for the Brazilians. They really had to go for everything there, or the, for the Japanese, or they really had to go for it. Superb defensive. Well, let's see what Fujii can come, um, come up with at 8 10. Very soft, safe serve there. And it's been recycled by Japan. Let's see if Portugal can put it away. No, they can't. Big stuff block. Huge from Haku Lee. That is the block of the match. Wow, that is a stunner. Well, Portugal a little bit unlucky with the first spike, but no luck there. Lee just taking control of the net there. And unbelievably, Philippe. Coming up later on. Commender, reverse, backcourt pipe, Slivka doesn't find the result he wants, but Poland have a second bite of the cherry. Musaj, not quite firing as he did last week. Dishikawa pushes long. Bednorz gets the touch. He was just absolutely on fire. Has 
11 aces for the competition, Eugene Nishida. Certainly force on that. Oh, Smith gets it down. Kogo with the overpass. Japan blocking really well. Smith's going to have another dig at it. No. Nishida with the defence. And then Fukuzawa gets up high to make Australia feel very low. 8-6. The lead of two. We're into the first technical timeout in this match. And Fukuzawa, who was littered with errors on the first two match days here in Varna, is really showing it. Three points to his name in double quick time. But Russia still lead by four. Diving again, defence. Nishida in the thick of it. Good improvisation. Oh, no, not on that occasion. The players quite literally getting tangled up together. Golibev, Libero. Ahead of uh, Onodera. Easy pass for Canada. Roll shot, so free ball. And what Brett Walsh is doing here is just trying to run the same play. Fuji. Both players with their number two setters, or both teams with their number two setter on court at the moment now. Yamamoto will get a hold of this. Now, where's this going to go? Lovely deep push attempt there from Ishikawa, but Portuguese managed to get on top of it, recycle it, but it comes back again. The initiative switches and a push once again. Too good this time, Ishikawa. Dropping it in over the block. Should Japan win this set, we'll go to a best of well, first rather to 15 decider. All these VNL contests are best of five sets. Williams off the block. Straightforward score for the Aussies. 8-7. And they side out. Arda Schwartz, who started this match. Coming back. Ma has to volley it over. Free ball to Japan. Good hands. Really good block from Vigras. And a mega rally developing here. Just out of the reach of... Grimov will try and hit this. Look how far back those rear court defenders have set themselves because they know Scrimov has the arsenal. They know he has the power to get to try and get Japan back in this third set. Rabenikov once again we see that cameo between the two. Terrific arm there from Nishida, really strong arm. Likewise from Rossard. This is really competitive. Tilly going for placement. There is Ishikawa. And the block comes in. And the points had already been awarded to France anyway. And France moved to within four. Let's look at this again. Ishikawa. Real delight to watch. Fizzing serve dealt with by Cleveno. Cleveno comes back again, but can't get any purchase on that spike. Good end view. And there. Once again, Japan come away with a point, and it's uh, Takano on that occasion. That was nice. Spread the... Oh, it's good defence, it's terrific, keeps the ball alive. Serbia have to go again. This time they get the, the ball through. And once again, it is Sirovic, starting to enjoy himself. Over on that left side there, going cross-court, getting the touch. Marco then serving at 15-12. Yamamoto struggling for that one. Now the pipe attack has been kept alive. Oh, it's going to come back Portugal's way again. They can reset here, send it near side, and that's nicely played by Marco Ferreira. Rubbing one off the block, and Portugal for the third time in as many sets, go to the second technical timeout in the lead. And it's another very healthy looking scoreline for them. Can they hold on this time? Can't 
find a way through that time. For Gazzara, again. Out it goes. Away goes the set from Japan. Poland 25, Japan. Panasonic Panthers, his club. Muzaj, power taken off. Yanagida has to take the power off. Quash and Commander are there to say no. Poland have the lead once more at 14 13. Quash, more stern than Anna.